Recording before noon. Look at me go. What's happening, film nerds? Dave the Film Junkie here. Welcome to the Sunday morning box office. Well, three minutes before noon, currently, when I'm recording this. So, hey, I'm making an effort to try to get this uh, the box office video up and running. I'm already on my second cup of, cup of coffee. Did I just say cup of coffee? Cool. If you're new to my box office video, I basically give the top five uh, domestic earnings. And then, of course, we look at the international because, hey, those numbers are quite important now because we're a little stingy in the States. We don't like to uh, go to the movies as much as we used to. Anyways... Coming in number five, we have blockers. Cock blockers, I guess you could say, because there's a rooster on there. We get what you're talking about. It made $10.3 million over the weekend, bringing that grand total domestically $36.9 million, $21 million budget. Definitely a success. Overall, it's made $52.9 million. I still got to check it out. I heard nothing but good things. Coming in number four. In his third week, we have Ready Player One. It made $11.2 million over the weekend, bringing that domestic grand total, which just, just should be more, $114.6 million. But of course, worldwide, it's creeping up to that half, uh, half a million or half a billion dollar mark at $474.4 million. Yeah, well, there you go. Coming to number three, uh, one of the newbies over the weekend, which was. Uh, eh, I'm, I've heard mainly bad things. Uh, Truth or Dare. It made $19 million over the weekend. Uh, $3.5 million budget. So it definitely is already a success. That's what's actually easy about like these weird, um, you know, these horror movies. I mean, I guess it's horror, horror, thriller, whatever. You can make them with such a small budget when you have a bunch of, you know, nobody known in the movie and, you know, simple concept, I guess. But uh, domestic, or overall, it's made $21.6 million. Foreign box office, not so much. Coming to number two, running really strong, only a $35.1 million drop, or percent drop. A Quiet Place, it made $32.6 million over the weekend. And uh, that grand total is $99.6 million, so it will definitely cross the $100 million mark by next week. Overall, with the, with the international numbers, we have $151.3 million. I love it! Small movie, John Krasinski's first direct, uh, first movie being a director, and he nailed it. And, and I absolutely love that. Huge success. It's this year's Get Out, and hopefully it'll get some of that uh, Oscar treatment. Anyways, coming in number one, just barely. <laughs> I mean, this is a big budget movie. It's got Dwayne Johnson, yet... I don't know. I mean, it's not it's not a flop for sure, but uh, I mean, it just barely edged out a quiet place. Rampage made thirty four point five million dollars, basically only two million dollars more, one hundred twenty million dollar budget. <laughs> and of course, foreign it kicks more ass. So uh, you know, worldwide it's made one hundred and forty eight point six million dollars. So. There you go. Um, pretty much, uh, I'm going to do that box office video I've been talking about because, you know, ever since Black Panther came out, stuff's been pretty telling. And if you look at the movies that have been coming out, quite diverse when it comes to uh, the leading people and what they're about. So, and, uh, you know, it, it kind of just, it's interesting. That's all I got to say. Anyways, guys, let me know what you saw over the weekend down below in the balls area and what you thought uh, what you thought about it hit that like thumbs up button if you'd be so kind subscribe to my channel visit filmjunkie.com for all my content and of course visit the closet for shirts and stickers all right guys I'll talk